Federation's rise to power had started years ago, when the great energy-producing deserts were destroyed. The world powers that depended on them collapsed, and in their wake, the Federation began to rise. The Federation united all of South America under one banner, and devoured everything in its path as it moved relentlessly to the north. After turning Odin against us, the Federation stood on the doorstep of America, poised for the kill. They thought we were weak, crippled, prey, waiting to be taken. We fought hard. We fought well. We fought them to a bloody stalemate. And here, just beyond the craters of no man's land, we find ourselves in a defensive war against a more powerful enemy. Survivors? Negative. Sorry to interrupt you. Thought you could use a sleep. Quiet boy. Listen. Hey, I just got something. Grab your gear, let's move. Sergeant, your area secure? Just about. You need to sweep this side of the wall and regroup. We'll take the left side. Think we're safe. Regroup at the gas station. You got it.
the old man. Dad. I heard about the attack. You boys okay? Always. Walk with me. Dad, they're executing civilians. I know. Their recon teams round up scavengers, drifters, hoping to find a way into the city. It's how they took Dallas practically overnight. So how can we help? Dad. Listen, you boys. You're the only thing I've got left in this world. Dad. But you're also the only ones I can trust. Hey, look. Whatever it is, Logan and I are ready. You two are going to no man's land. Wait, for real? We've been on the defensive for far too long. So I'm sending you outside the walls. You'll link up with a recon team. Gather any intel you can on the enemy. And get your asses back here. So where in no man's land are we going? Somewhere you know better than anyone. You're going home. We call it No Man's Land. It's a span of destruction between LA and San Diego. When Odin was turned against us. The beaches and surf breaks of my own childhood were now mined and abandoned. Dad told us few men got to operate in no man's land. It was too dangerous, too unpredictable. He was sending us out there. It must have been important to him. Still, I couldn't help but think this was another one of his tests, a lesson he was trying to teach us.